Exercise medicine is a movement that really started in America where um, we understood the quality of physiological outcomes that can be had by people who exercise. Um, but more than that, it was about trying to get that information from the sport and exercise scientists around the world into the hands of the clinicians, so to speak, the allied health professionals that see the patients. And if we could get those allied health professionals and clinicians to reach for the prescription pad for movement or exercise as a first order of business, that would be much better than reaching it for, for pharmacological agents, uh, drugs. And if we think about the London 2012 Olympic Games, we campaigned as a nation on a health legacy. Um, however, we didn't, we didn't yield the health benefits we thought we would. The participation didn't go up. The health benefits weren't yielded for the NHS, and we still have a chronic disease epidemic. And so the powers that be thought, let's invest in research and development in this area. And you know, can we, where else in the country could we do that besides Loughborough University, which has a long uh, tradition and a lot of research power in this area. The types of students that we're looking for on this program um, are, are, are varied. Uh, it could be a person in traditional sports and exercise science, so people interested in exercise physiology, um, but it also could be people that are interested in the rehabilitation sciences. But at the same time, we have a psychological leaning in the sense that the program is designed to help us understand the physiology of the individual patient, client, or participant. But then once we do those deep phenotyping tests in our laboratories, we have to sit and counsel um, those folks uh, about their outcomes. And then you can see there's a psychological bent in, in that counseling process. So thinking about lifestyle medicine, it could be about their exercise, it could be about their nutrition, it could be about their immunological function, and there's a nice host of optional modules there for students to, to decorate their CVs in different areas. The timing couldn't be more right for this. We have an NHS system that's uh, struggling to keep up with the lifestyle chronic diseases, uh, and we have a government who's investing in novel solutions. Uh, and this program should give the students novel tools uh, to approach this uh, area of research.